As we celebrate Veterans Day this weekend, we're introducing you to one of two pups here in Metro Atlanta being trained to become a service dog for veterans. It's all through an organization called Warrior Canine Connection. Al Fox Eyes Ken Loeffler has more from Peachtree City tonight. Four-month-old Corey here is one of the first two pups with Warrior Canine Connection being trained in the state of Georgia. And now the organization is hoping to expand throughout the area. Are you down? Good girl. She is learning basic cues or commands. Housebreaking was one of the initial things, just basic house manners. I say hello. Hello. These are just some of the first steps as Corey begins her journey to become a service dog for veterans. They have different ranks. She's at the boots rank, which is the lowest. Next will be private and then sergeant. Uh, and they work up to general. Each of the dogs, the Warrior Canine Connection, got named after service members. Corey's namesake is U.S. Navy Petty Officer Second Class Karina Dubois, who was one of the first women to be stationed on a combat ship. The training starts with puppy parents like Sue. Person? Jim, my husband is a veteran and many of his family members also. We're retired so we thought well we could start the puppies early because we're home with them all day. Then the dogs work with veterans to finish up training before being placed with a veteran with disabilities. According to Warrior Canine Connection, one dog can help more than 60 warriors through the training process by tackling post deployment challenges such as isolation and anxiety. The organization is based in Maryland with two pups here in Fayette County, but they're hoping to place more in Georgia. Giving back, it's a good way. The veterans have, have sacrificed a lot for what they've done, and this is one way for us to show our appreciation. For more information on how you can get involved, head to our website, fox5atlanta.com. In Peachtree City, Kim Luffler, Fox 5 News.